Hello. Hello. Good evening, Tatiana. How are you? Good. And you? Nice. Very nice. I'm happy because today is Friday. Yeah, today is Friday. Oh, yes. Uh, I needed some vacation. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And I need vacation too. <laughs> need vacation. What What time do you work every day? Hola. What time do you work? ¿A qué horas trabajo? Mm -hmm. Ah, yo no trabajo. I don't work yet. Oh, lucky well, you. you. I work lucky. at home. Ah. Uh, <laughs> that, that is different. That is different. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see who's going to come tonight. Let's see. Okay, very good. Everybody's connecting. I see Nancy Sanchez. That's good. Let's get some people involved. Who else is going to be in the class? Okay, I don't know what happened to the rest of the people. Mm -hmm. they, they overslept. Se les pegó la cobija. They overslept. Yeah. Or maybe I was early tonight. I was two minutes earlier. Dos minutos. Estaba temprano. I was very early today. Okay, let's see where, where we left off yesterday. What we did, let's see what, what we did yesterday, okay? Uh, good evening, teacher. Hey, good uh -huh. evening, good evening. Good okay. evening, teacher. Good evening. So let's see what we did yesterday. Uh, we did this, we did this, we did this. And yesterday we were at this one, I guess. Yeah. Questions would be. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. We did that. We did this. We did this. Okay. We did this. Yeah. Here. We're going to start from here. Okay, let's see how many people we got. Okay, so uh, yesterday we were talking about uh, simple present or the verb be, the verb be we were talking about. So we started from here because we did this. So we, we're going to continue from here, I guess, from here. Okay, so let's start with people who already are in the class, okay? Okay, let's see how many we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine. Wait, let me go back. Okay, so we have 12. Okay, we can start right now, okay? So yesterday we were talking about um, uh, the verb be. How do we use the verb be and what are the uses we do it, okay? So let's, let's move on with that and let's see what we have. Let's see here. So we're going to continue with this, okay? 
So let's see. I'm going to start from here. Whoa, my bad. Okay, here. Let's see. Okay, um, Tatiana, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, can you read this part, please? Okay. How to use the, the to be bear. The most tricky thing about this bear, however, is that it's also one of the most irregular bear in the English language. This means that you like regular verbs, which barely change when using when different subjects, subject, or even in different tense. And, and when they do, they follow a partner. The, the V verb changed almost completely in most of its form. Thank you. All right. Remember that we were talking about, uh, yesterday we were talking about things that you should already know. For example, how many tenses uh, you should know already. Um, for example, uh, we were saying that um, the present continuous, the simple future, the simple past, the simple present, the present perfect, and the past continuous. Six tenses that you uh, have to know already because you are pre-intermediate or at least the first four, which is present continuous, simple future, simple past, and simple present. Those you should know already, okay? So the verb be changes in every tense. For example, in simple, simple present is, is, are, am. But in simple past, it, it is was and where. Okay? And future, in simple future, it, it, it could be going to, going to. And it goes to the base form. Okay? And in simple past, it changes uh, because it would be, well, Simple past, simple future, simple present. That's it. Um, okay. So, any questions here in this part? Questions? No question. Okay, moving on. Uh, next, uh, Nancy, can you read this part, please? Forms of B. Since the verb is Highly irregular, it's written in different ways according to, to the tense of the verb, whether it is a present past, future, or even in mixed tense. And it also varies according to the subject. Let's see the form this verb can take when used next to the subject. Good. Remember what is the subject, right? What is the subject? Do you have any idea what is the subject? Anybody? Do you know what is Sujeto. Tell me one example. An example of a subject? You. You. I. I. He. You. He, I. He. She. It. They. Good. So, and he's saying, since the verb is highly irregular, it's written in different ways according to the tense of the verb, whether if it is present, past, or future. Okay? So, in the simple future, the verb be is not am. It, it, it could be like, a, yes, uh, it could be like different from, from, uh, from the present or the past. Okay, let's move on. Let's go see next. Okay, let's see form of Grisela. Can you read this part, please? Okay, this is the most basic form uh, of the verb, and it's how we can find it in the dictionary. Is must mostly uh, used when using imperatives and also as the infinitive. Some examples are, be nice to your sister. I like to be in my house. Good, thank you. Okay, as you can see, 
it is used on mm -hmm. imperatives. What is an imperative? Do you know what is an imperative? Okay, an imperative is like an order, like somebody gives you an order. For example, your mom tells you, um, please, um, no, 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 please. If it is an order, then they don't say please. So it would say, uh, clean, clean the house or do the dishes, wash the dishes, um, do the laundry. So it is an order. So that is imperative. Los imperativos son órdenes que usted recibe de alguien, ya sea su mamá o su papá o alguien más. So those are imperatives, orders. And the infinitive is just a regular sentence. Los infinitivos son eh, eh, oraciones normales. For example, I like to be in my house. Me gusta estar en la casa. Una oración normal, okay? Questions? Preguntas? No, teacher. Good. Moving on. Okay, the present. Let's see who's next. Walter, can you read this this part, please? Walter? Well, present. This form of the verb is mainly mainly used in the simple present, and its meaning can change depending on the use the use in the context. Also, when writing the present form of the verb, of the that be verb can be short, shortened. shortened. A shortened. Here is the to be form all the subjects in the both long and short form for affirmative sentence and also for negative sentences with to be. Good, thank you very much. So remember that the meaning can change depending on the use in the context. So puede cambiar lo que significa dependiendo del contexto. Okay, no es lo mismo decir I'm working que decir I'm working in my house. So la, depende de cómo se diga algo, okay? Moving on, any questions? vocabulary or anything no cool let's move on then uh, uh, what what question yeah yes uh, i don't know what is uh, mainly mainly principalmente yeah, principalmente mainly uh, principalmente. thank you you're welcome okay let's move on then let's see who's next reading Okay, Jaime, can you read this, please? Okay, teacher. Um, except for, uh, except for, uh, of these four sentences, uh, why, why the three birds uh, for nice, cheese, chayla, um, for for age, he is six years old. For feeling, feeling, Lauren and Sandra are happy. For nationality, for nationalities. ¿Cómo se diría? ¿Cómo se dice en, eh, esta palabra? Nationalities. Nationalities. For nationalities. Ah, uh, for nationalities. Uh, we are from Thailand. Uh, for professionals, you are in, you are in a parent, a painter. You are a sing, a singer. 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 Good. A singer. Okay, so these are uh, examples for ages, for names, for feelings, and for nationalities, and for professions as well. Any questions so far? We're good. Okay. Cool. Okay, let's see who's next here. Uh, okay, Eliseo, can you read this this chart, please? Okay, to be contractions. Contraction of to be are very frequent when we are speaking. To be, I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, you are, they are. Contraction. I'm, 
your, his, she's, it's, where, uh, your, your, yes, there, 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 there. Examples. I'm from New Zealand. Your children. He's 20, 20 years old. She's a nurse. He's a big dog. We're intelligent. Your student. They are married. Very good. Thank you very much. So these are the contractions. Uh, how we how we do the contraction depends on how fast can you speak. And using contractions is very good because um, actually. Uh, you may sound American. Maybe Americans, they love to use contractions, okay? Let's see what is next. Okay, let's see, Max, can you read this chart, please? Okay. Wait, the bird... oh, sorry, my bad, my bad. Now? Yeah, yeah, go. Okay. The verb to be, affirmative statement, expression, example. Be from place, I am from Mexico. She is from Germany. Be in place. We are in Tijuana. They are in library. Very good. Thank you. So affirmative, affirmative statements. Do you know what is a statement? Does anybody what is a statement in, in Spanish? In Spanish, what is it? What does it mean? Oraciones. No, oraciones son uh, sentences. Afirmaciones. Afirmaciones, yes, afirmaciones o aseveraciones. Algunos le llaman aseveraciones o afirmaciones. Okay, so um, it's different to be I am from Mexico than, than, than saying I am in Mexico. So, for example, I can say I'm, I am from San Miguel, but I am in San Salvador. So it's very different. Okay, any questions? So far, everything good, right? Cool, moving on. Let's practice. So this is about the B. Remember B. So let's let's see what we have to practice. Okay, G blank not at home in the morning. What is the correct answer? Cheese. Okay. Cheese. Uh, she is not at home in the morning. She is not at home in the morning. Everybody repeating. She is not at home in the morning. Not at home in the morning. She is not at home in the morning. Good. Let's go. She is not at home in the morning. She is not at home in the morning. Good. Let's go for number two. Our friends blank the friends the holiday. Are our friends are on their summer holiday. Our friends are on their summer holiday. Everybody? Our friends are on their summer holiday. Our friends are on their summer holiday. Our friends are our on friends their are on their summer holiday. On the summer holiday. Good. Uncle George blank a good soccer player. Uncle George blank a good soccer player. Uncle George is a good soccer player. Soccer player. Yes. Uncle George is a good soccer player. Everybody. Uncle George is a good soccer player. Uncle George is a good soccer player. One more time. Uncle George is a good soccer player. Very good. I blank planning I to get a good score in the test. I am. I am. I am. I am. You guys are good. You guys are good. That's very easy. Okay. I am planning to get a good score in the test. Everybody. I, I, am, am I am planning, planning to, to get a good score, score, score in the test. Good. Let's go for the next. His t-shirt's very cool. His t-shirt is very cool. No. Is our... Porque porque termina con S, es plural. His t-shirt's are very cool. Are very cool. Everybody. His t-shirts are, are very cool. No, no, no. His t-shirts. Mencionen la S, es plural. His t-shirts are very cool. Very cool. Yes, very good. Okay. Okay, we finish with that. So let's go for the next lesson. And this is the according what we have in, in, the, in the platform. 
So in the platform is achievement indicator. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation between two people where yes, no questions and short answers with B are introduced. Everybody? Everybody. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation, to a conversation between two people where yes or no questions. People where yes, no questions, short answer with the R introduced. Okay, listen one more time. In this lesson, wait, in this lesson, participants. Wait, listen, listen, participants. Listen, participants. Listen. listen. <laughs> okay, pay attention to me, okay? Uh, follow the instructions. Okay, listen. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation between two people where yes, no questions, and short answers with B are introduced. Everybody. In this lesson, participants listen to a conversation between people where yes, no questions, short answer with the R introduced. I was glad the R introduced. Okay, so according to the platform, de acuerdo a la plataforma, van a escuchar una conversación ahí entre dos personas donde van a hacerse preguntas de sí o no y se van a dar respuestas cortas. Okay, so let's go. This is according to the forum or discussion in the platform. Okay, everybody listen. Are you, are your English classes interesting? Are your English classes interesting? Todos. Are you, um, are your English, English classes, classes interesting? interesting? Are your English classes interesting? Are your English classes interesting? Interesting. 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 Are your English classes interesting? Are your English classes interesting? Positive. Yes, they are. Yes, yes, they are. They yes, are. They are. Negative. No, they aren't. No, no they, they aren't. aren't. Are you and Tony in the same class? Are, are you, and you and Tony in the same, same, same class? class? Are you and Tony in the same class? Are you, are you, are you, you and Tony, in the, Tony in the same class? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Yes, yes, we, we are. are. No, we are. Is your teacher from San Miguel? Is your yes, teacher, teacher from, from San Miguel? Miguel? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Yes, he, he is. is. No, he, he isn't. isn't. Are your classmates very friendly? Are your, are your, your classmates very friendly? friendly? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Yes, yes, they, they are. are. No, they are. Am I a good student? Am I a good student? I am I a good student? Yes, you are. No, you aren't. Yes, you are. No, you aren't. Good. Take your screenshot. Take your screenshot to practice. A screenshot. <laughs> And my time. A screenshot, take a screenshot to practice. A screenshot. Okay. I got it. You got I, it? I yes. got it. Okay, yes. okay. Let's let's go and practice. Okay, as usual, remember to listen to your classmates and he makes any mistakes, you correct them, okay? Escuchen a su compañero y cuando cometan errores. Uh, corríjanse entre ustedes, por favor. Here we go. Yes. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Okay, go to your rooms and start practicing. Go to your rooms and start practicing. Go to your uh, to your room and start uh, practicing.
So, guys. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Are you English classes interesting? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Okay. Are you and Tony in the same class? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Is your teacher from San Miguel? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Are your classmates very friendly? Yes, yes they, they are. are. No, no, they aren't. aren't. Am I a good student? Yes, you yes, are. You are. are. No, no, you aren't. You are. Okay. All right. All right. Are your English classes interesting? Interesting. 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 Me Primero uno y luego el otro. ¿A quién le vas a preguntar, Walter? Um, siempre a usted, tenga, a usted. Ojo, ojo. Siempre tengan Ajá, esa siempre costumbre. En el nombre, sí. Siempre costumbren de que le eh, dirijan el nombre a quien va la pregunta. Por ejemplo, yo le puedo decir, Hey, Walter, are your English classes interesting? O so, digan el nombre para que sepa quién va a contestar, please. Ajá. It's okay. Aquí, aquí. Eh, entre ustedes dos, pues, inician entre ustedes dos, sí. Ah, ok, este, Jaime. Ok, Janet, ok, esta pregunta. Am, am I a good student? Am I? Am I? Am I, am I, am I a good student? Am I? Am no, I, teacher? Es que, es que no, no haga la pausa, no diga en I. Yes, no, you pégala, are. Pégala, pégala, uh -huh. no, diga am I. Am I. Am I. Am I a good student? Yes, you are. No, you aren't. Vaya, hoy ya empiece otro. <laughs> are you, are you, a, are your English class interesting? Classes, interesting. are your English classes interesting? Interesting. Interesting. Are you English class interesting? Classes. Classes, classes it's plural, it's plural. Classes. Yes. Are you? You are. Mm -hmm. okay. Bien. Eh, las, palabras quizá, las palabras quizás que de repente, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. interest, interesting. 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 Es como, es como que llevara un número tres en medio. Interesting. 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 Yo decía interesting. Interesting. No. <laughs> interesting. 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 Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Para mí, hoy termino. Ya termino. Chao. Bye. No, ahí está. No lo escuchamos, teacher. <laughs> My microphone was off. So, sorry, sorry. Ah. Whenever I come back from, from the rooms, it's always off. Okay, so uh, how was the practice? Guys, I, I, I was in some rooms and I was seeing that you were wasting time. Estaban perdiendo el tiempo. No se tiren la bola. No, pregúntame tú, pregúntame. Yo le pregunto. No, de un solo pregúntele a quien se sea. Pero ojo, dirijan la, eh, la pregunta a la persona para, para que sepa quién va a contestar. Por ejemplo, yo le puedo decir, eh, Nancy, are your classes interesting? O puedo decir, hey, Vladimir, are your classes interesting? So, dirijan siempre la pregunta para que nadie se quede. 
¿Qué pasó? ¿A quién va? So, para eso es que tenemos que definir quién va a contestar, ¿ok? Please. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, fíjense de que este, nosotros, bueno, casualmente me ha tocado con mis compañeros de ayer, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Pero eh, cuando hay tiempo, ¿verdad? Lo hacemos así. Nos contestamos, pero eh, a veces preferimos leerlo todo, pues para ver nuestras debilidades en la pronunciación. Uh -huh. eh, no sé si está bien, pues porque es como yo digo toda la conversación, no, por decirlo de no, la práctica, más. Lo que para yo practicar vi, más. Mor el mor primer... Ok, cuando ya estén eh, allí, pues lo que les funcione mejor. Pero ah, siempre ah. escuchen a su compañero y corríjanse, ¿ok? Sí, sí, de acuerdo. Cool, cool. Sí. Ok, let's, let's move on and let's see what we have next. Continuamos y veamos qué tenemos después. Let's move on. Here we go. So, this is what we have. Next. Eh, uh, the verb be, again. ¿Por qué tenemos dos verb be? Porque las, los dos topics que estaban anteriores hablan de lo mismo. So, por eso lo partí en dos. Ok, let's go. Um, let me just go here. Ok, let's see. Uh, Max, can you start reading, please? Okay. The verb be. I am, you are, he, she, it is, we are, they are, not. We use you for one person or for more than one person. We use you in formal and informal situations. Thank you. Thank you very much, Max. Okay, remember that yesterday I was saying that you, sh you have to be careful with you because it can be for one person or it can be for plurals so in, in spanish it would be tú y ustedes so that that's how, how it is in english okay that you have to be careful and this is going to depend and you're going to notice depending on the context lo van a descubrir si es para una persona o para varias personas en el contexto okay o al final de, de una oración okay Cool. Let's go. Okay, Vero, can you do this, please? Okay, question four. Uh, am, I, uh, am, am I? Am I? Am I? Am I? Are you? Is he? She? It? Are we? Are they? Good. So this is how you make questions in the B form. For example, si usted quiere decir, soy yo inteligente, usted va a decir, am I intelligent? Si usted quiere decir, se referirse a usted mismo y, y quiere preguntarle a alguien más, um, eh, ¿soy un buen cantante? ¿Am I a good singer? O cualquiera, pero cuando se refiere a usted, a su persona, va a comenzar con, ¿Am I? ¿Todos? ¿Am I? ¿Am I? Good. Am I? So, si yo le pregunto a, 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 a Tatiana, Tatiana, ¿Am I a good teacher? ¿Qué me va a contestar, Tatiana? Yes, you are. Thank you very much. Ahora usted pregúntele a, a, a Vladimir algo con, con, de usted propio. Sí. Um, Vladimir, am I a good student? <laughs> yes, you are. Yes, you are. Very good. See, I got it. You, you guys are, are getting it. Lo están entendiendo bien. I like it. Good. And the second one is, are you? But remember that you can be singular or it can be plural. Recuerden que puede ser singular o puede ser plural. So, en este caso podemos decir, eh, me refiero solo a Tati. Eh, are you a good student? Y usted me va a responder. Yes, I'm a... Yes, yes. I am. I am. Yes, I am. I am. Uh -huh. Very good. Okay. Pero si yo digo a todos, para todos, are you good students? Ojo. Lo van a definir, van a saber de qué es para todos porque va a terminar con S. Entonces yo voy a decir, are you good students? Si yes, se oye la S. Yes, Entonces, ¿Cómo van a contestar ustedes? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Ok, very yes, good. En cambio, si quiero hablar de tercera persona y voy a hablar de Janet, voy a decir, is she a good student? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. She is. She is. Pero yes. si hablo de Walter yes. y digo, is he a good student? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Si quiero usar el it, ¿para qué utilizamos el it? Acuérdense. Para animales y cosas. Animales, cosas animales. y plantas. Y plantas. plantas. Okay. So, puedo decir, is, is, that, my dog. 
is the dog good? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Very yes, good. Yes, it is. Ok, y los plurales ya eso están predefinidos. En eso no, no tenemos problema. Ok. Yes. How can we improve the listening? Oh, actually, eh, if you want me to, si todos están de acuerdo, les puedo crear un extra, eh, extra trabajo para que puedan utilizar listening y repetition. ¿Está bien? Yes. Yes. Excellent. Okay, okay. Um, teacher, yes. tengo una duda. Eh, ¿Verdad que actually es exactamente? Actually. Actually. No. Actually. No. ¿Qué es actually? Actually es, es como decir eh, de hecho. De hecho. De hecho. Mm -hmm. Por ejemplo, alguien me puede decir, hey, um, you're not, uh, are you teaching right now? ¿Estás uh, dando clases hoy mismo? Actually, I am. I am teaching a lot of classes right now. De hecho, estoy, estoy dando clases mucho, mucho tiempo. Ok. Solo, 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 ese, solo de hecho es cerrado. El, el, no hay sinónimo. No. no, no, no. Solo de hecho, de hecho. Muchas, muchas personas se confunden y dicen, actualmente. No, no. no currently. <risa> currently. 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 Actualmente. Oh. O algunas veces se usa eso de nowadays. Nowadays. En estos días. Nowadays. Ok. Ok. Thank cool. you, teacher. Um, Okay, let's see. Let's move on then. Let's move on. Let's see what we have next. Estamos entendiendo hasta el momento lo que estamos utilizando, ¿correcto? Yes. Okay, good. So let's move on. Let's see what we have next. Okay, moving on. Short answers. Oh, podemos tener short, eh, respuestas answer. cortas o respuestas largas según quien esté hablando con nosotros, ¿ok? So, eh, Vladimir, can you read this part, please? Okay, short answer. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, you aren't. Yes, he, she, it is. No, he, she, is. it isn't. Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Good. Y esto... ¿Cuándo va a ser que lo vamos a utilizar? Cuando no queremos dar explicación o cuando no se nos piden una explicación, ¿sí? Entonces, por ejemplo, si yo le digo, are you a good student? Yes, I am, me va a decir. Pero si yo le digo, are you a good student? Why? Entonces, ahí ya le pido explicación. Entonces, usted me dice, yes, I am, because I study a lot. ¿Ya? Cuando se pide explicación, entonces ya la, la respuesta se vuelve larga. O cuando hay que denotar algo que usted quiere que alguien sepa, lo alarga. ¿Ok? So, okay. si alguien le pregunta, are you a good student? Yes, I am, because I always get A's in my tests. Sí, porque siempre me saco 10 en los exámenes. ¿Correcto? ¿O no? Cuando queremos más información. Ah, sí, exacto. O cuando queremos que algo sobresalga de mi información. ¿Ok? Cool. Ok, yes, no question, short answers with verb. Aquí ya vamos a ver algunas eh, respuestas cortas, ok? Let's move on. Ok, Janet, can you read this please? Janet? Ok, ok. Yes, no question. B, I, I, am, R, is, subject, and verb, the chance, their position in the statement, Indication. Sentence, you are from Germany. Question, are you from Germany? We always use the short answers. No, only yes or no. Not. If the answer is yes, we always use the long form. Example, yes, I am. If the answer is not, we, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Either. We either. We either use the loan on the contract, contract, contracted, contracted, contracted form, short form, example, no, I am not, no, I am not. Mm, no, la primera no, es no, I am I, not. Am, am I? No, no I no, am no, la, I primera, am not. la primera es no, I am not, I am pero not. la segunda es no, I am not, I am not. no, I am not. I am not. Okay, so um, that's how we use it. 
Pero lo puede decir de las dos formas. Si, si usted solo quiere usar no I am not, that's good. Pero si usted quiere contactarlo, no I am not. ¿Questions? No. ¿Alguna pregunta hasta el momento, chicos? Yes. Yeah. Uh, el significado de if al principio, uh, al principio de la dos de las dos últimas. Para un filler. Yes. If is, uh, is um, en la palabra if es yes. un is um, mm. como cómo sería eso condición es una condición okay. si la condición se cumple usted va a hacer una cosa si la condición no se cumple usted va a hacer otra cosa so if es condición entonces en la primera parte diría como si la respuesta es sí, ¿Sí? y la condición ah ok Traxión. entonces la condición le pone que sí es yes usted va a contestar yes I am yes, y en la negativa, si la condición dice que comienza con no, usted va a decir no and not, no and not. No hay and not o no and not. ¿Ok? So, okay. se fijan, el if es condición. ¿Ok? Una condicionante. Eh, ¿Alguien tiene otra pregunta? ¿Anybody else has a question? No. Either. 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 No, either, either use the long. Es, either es como... Tenemos dos opciones para dónde agarrar. Ese es, es either indica opciones. Dos opciones. opciones sí. Gracias. Bueno, uh, yo lo podría hacer en un ejemplo como, I, tonight I either watch television or listen to music. Esta noche music. tengo la, la opción de escuchar música o ver televisión. So, either usa dos opciones, ¿ok? Sí. Good. Yeah. No más questions? No. Okay. No. Let's move on. Okay, let's see who's next to read here. Let's see. Ulises, can you read this part, please? Verb. Uh, verb. Subject. Press. Yes, no. Subject. Verb. Are. Are you from Germany? Yes, I am. Are you from Germany? No, I am not. Is he your friend? Yes, he is. Are Peter and John from England? John. Yes, from they are. Okay, thank you very much. These are only examples of how to use uh, the B in, in, in responses, in short answers. For example, check this one up. Are you from Germany? No, I am not. But it also gives you the contraction. No, I'm not. Okay? Okay. We understand this part, right? Yes. Cool. Thank you very much. Let's move on. Yes. Oh, short answers with me. Uh, let's see who's going to read this. Grisela, can you read this, please? Okay. Short answer with me. Answers. 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 With me, uh, it is um, possible to give a short answer or a long answers to our questions in English. Do, do. So, in casual conversation, short answers uh, are much more common than long answers. Long answers are for more formal conversation or if you want to give more information in your response. Yes, very good. Thank you, thank you. Um, so, as I said before, this is going to depend on you. Esto va a depender de usted. Si usted quiere dar una, una respuesta larga o una corta. La mayoría solo da una corta. A veces somos un poquito saraganes y decimos, oh, yes, no, I'm not. Or, yes, I am. So, entonces, si usted quiere dar más o, o, o por decirlo así, um, eh, si usted quiere dar a conocer más información, usted alarga la, la, la respuesta. ¿Questions? ¿Preguntas? No, teacher. Very good. Let's move on then. Loki, loki. Let's see who's next here. Okay, Jennifer, can you read this part, please? She questions that is, is or are it is possible to give short answers as follows. Simple questions. Am I late? Are you tired? Are you both happy? Are they thirsty? Is he sick again? 
Is she a good teacher? Is it a viable? Short answer, affirmative. Yes, you are. Yes, I am. Yes, we are. Yes, they are. Yes, he is. Yes, she is. Yes, it is. Short answer, negative. No, you aren't. No, I'm not. No, we aren't. No, they aren't. No, he isn't. No, she isn't. No, it isn't. Thank you very much. Okay, these are just examples of how you are doing. So any questions here about vocabulary or anything? Pregunta sobre algo, no? Uh, un, uh, one question. Yes, sí, sir. Uh, uh, sin, uh, well, el significado de is he sick? Is sick he sick again? Ah, uh, is he sick again? Sick es enfermo. Y again, sick. otra vez. ¿Está él enfermo otra vez? Otra vez. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sí. Okay. Entonces, puede decir, muchas personas no saben o, o, o casi no se usa la palabra IUL. I-L-L. IUL también significa enfermo. Ok. ¿Any other question? No, we're good then. We're good. I like it. Let's practice. Ok, practiquemos. I like practice. A mí me gusta la práctica. Por eso son ejemplos de la gente. Claro, igual a mí. <laughs> Siempre les incluyo esto. Porque... <laughs> ok, let's go. Ahí let's todo talta mudo, pero... <laughs> hey, esto nos ayuda a, a mejorar. Are you from England? Yes. I am. Yes, sir. Are you from England? Are you from England? Yeah. Are you from England? Yes, I am. Yes, yes I, am. I am. Yes, I am. From England? Yes, I am. Todos? Yes. Are you from England? Are you from yes, England? I am. Yes, I am. Oh, oh. England. 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 Are you from England? England. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Are you from England? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Ojo, no vayan a estar diciendo, yes, I am. No. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I am. I am. I am. I am. Yes, yes. La mayoría, muchos se equivocan y dicen, yes, I am. No, yes, I am. Sí le van a entender, pero una correcta pronunciación es, yes, I am. ¿Ok? I am. Yes, I am. Good. Moving on. I am. Are your friends at school? Yes. Blank? Yes. They are. Yes, they are. Are your friends at school? Yes, they are. Todos. Are your friends at school? Yes, they are. 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 Thank you. Are you 22 years old? No. no I'm not. I'm not. I am not. I'm not. There you go. Are you 22 years old? No, I am not. No, I am not. Are you 22 years old? No, I'm not. I, I am not. No, I am not. No, no I am not. not. No, I am not. Are you 22 years old? No. I not. No, I am not. No, I am not. No, I am not. Good. Si ustedes me preguntan, teacher, are you 23 years old? Yo le voy a decir, no, I am not. I wish. I wish. No, I'm 36 years old. I'm 36 years old. Los acabo de cumplir el 15 de septiembre, okay? So, moving on. Is the dog in the garden? Yes. In the garden. It is. Yes. Yes. It, yes. It, it is. It is. Is the dog in the garden? Yes, it is. is. Everybody? Is the dog in the is garden? The is the dog in the garden? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Very good. Yes, it is. Are your friends from Italy? Are your friends from No. Not no, they, they, are, they are not. No, they are not. No, they are not. There you go. Are your parents from no. Italy? No, they are not. Todos? Are you parents from Italy? Are you from Italy? Italy? No, they are, they are not. They are not. Are your parents from Italy? No, they are not. Are your parents from Italy? No, they are not. From Italy? No, they are not. 
Italy. Italy. Are your Italy. parents from Italy? No, they are not. No, are your parents from Italy? No, they are not. Okay, good. Italy. Italy. Okay, very good. So, and we go to the next thing. Yeah, the next thing is the next lesson according to the platform, okay? The achievement indicator is that at the end of this lesson, participants will be able to make yes, no questions and give short answers would be. Todos Please, Mariano, lesson, participants will be able to make yes, no questions and give short answers would be. And give short answers and give short answers. 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 Okay, everybody, are you free on Saturday night? Are you free, are on, you Saturday free night? on Saturday night? night? Are you free on Saturday night? Are you free on Saturday night? Are you free on Saturday night? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. I yes, have a date. No, I'm not. I have yes, a date. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. No, I'm no, not. I have, I have a date. date. I have a date. ¿Qué significa I have a date? Tengo una cita. Tengo una cita. Yes, una tengo cita. una cita amorosa. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Good. Are you free on Saturday night? Todos. Are you free on, Are you free on Saturday night? night? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. I have a date. No, I'm not. No, I am. I have a date. Entonces, ¿qué significa la pregunta? Are you free on Saturday night? Que estás libre el sábado por la noche. Yes, estás libre el sábado por la noche. Very good. Is David watching a movie with his girlfriend? Is David watching a movie with his girlfriend? Oh, girlfriend, 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 girlfriend. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. He is. No, he isn't. No, no, he isn't. He's still at work. He's still at work. He's still at work. He's still at work. Is your English class in the morning? Is your, is your English, English class, class in the morning? morning? Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, yes, it, it, is. Is. No, it, it is. is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Am I a good dancer? Am, Am I, I a good dancer? dancer? Yes, you are. Yes, yes you, you are. are. Yes, you are. No, you aren't. No, no you, you aren't. You aren't. No. You're the worst dancer ever. Sí, alguien me dijo eso una vez. <risa> sí, sí, ¿saben qué quiere decir eso? You're the worst. Yes. Worst. Eres el worst. peor. Eres el peor bailador. Ah. <risa> Todos los tiempos. <risa> ok. Tengo dos pies. <risa> Tengo dos pies izquierdos. Izquierdos. <risa> ok. ¿Are Carlos y Nana going out? Are Carlos and Anna going, going out? out. I'm going. Yes, they and, are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. No, they aren't. They're just friends. No, they no, they are. are. They aren't. They are just friends. They are they are just friends. Okay, screenshot. Screenshot. Screenshot to practice. Let's go to practice. I got it. Everybody got the screenshot? Yes. yes. Cool. Let's go. Oh. Escalera. Okay, listo. Okay. Gracias. So remember to practice and listen to your classmate and make corrections, please. Let's go. Go to your rooms and start practicing. Go to your rooms and start practicing.
Laura, mau gimana masuk? Mbak, um, Max, is David watching a movie with his girlfriend? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. He's still at work. Okay? Okay. Now Eliseo is here. Okay? Eliseo, ask for Tatiana or me. Well, <laughs> Eliseo, is Eliseo? your English class in the morning? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Words, mm. dijo esa palabra, ¿verdad? Words. Words, yes. Words. 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 Vladimir, is David watching a movie with his girlfriend? Girlfriend. Vladimir ya se fue a acostar, quizás mi muchachito. <laughs> Vladimir, te fuiste. <laughs> Okay, Salud, pues. Qué rato, pues, rato, pues, rato, rato estaba hablando y tenía el micrófono apagado. Ay, Dios mío. Está yes, bien. Yes, he is. No, he is. He is still at work. Ok. Eh, Ulises, ¿am I a good dancer? Yes, you are. No, you aren't. You're the, the worst dancer ever. You say that are Carlos and Anna going going out? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. They're just friends. Uh, Vladimir, are you free on Saturday night? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. I have a date. Uh, Veronica, am I a good dancer? Yes, you are. Okay. Yes, they are. No, yes, sí, they are. Ahí dice they are. Yes, they are. No, they are. They're just friends. Okay, excellent. Okay. Now, Eliseo, ask, Eliseo, are excellent. you free on Saturday, Saturday night? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. I have a date. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, Eliseo, is David watching a movie with his girlfriend? I have a date. Yes, yes, he is. No, he isn't. He is still, uh, still at work. Still, he, he is still at work. Okay, now Eliseo, he is Tatiana. still at work. <laughs> okay. Ah, sí, más grande, sí, sí, la yo, miro. Sí, yo, yo creo que todos, <risa> todos le hicimos ya, ¿verdad? Ya. Sí. Ya. Sorry. Ok. Bye. Ya practicamos. <risa> ok. Teacher, in microphone. I'm back, I'm back. I'm coming back from the future. So that was a good um, good class tonight. Um, so remember that next week is going to be normal, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, okay? Only this week because we started on Tuesday, we did it until Friday, okay? See. All right, guys. So have a good weekend, and I'll see you on Monday. God willing, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, hey. Yeah. Remember that the homework for Sunday, your introduction, little video to my WhatsApp, okay? Teacher, antes que se vaya, no quiero quedarme con la duda. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Es just, just. Eh, oh, they're just, they're just friends. Just. They're just friends. Just friends. Thank you. Cool.
Have a nice <laughs> weekend, guys. Go yeah. to the party, go to the beach, I don't know, do something, but make sure <laughs> have a good weekend. Good weekend. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> have a nice week bye. Everybody. Have a good night. Good have a good night, night. Okay. Thank, you, so guys. Thank you very much. Night. Have a good night.